Welcome to Dexter Plays Sunless Sea by Fail Better Games. Welcome back to the Sunless Sea. Last episode, we got ourselves redirected at the Salt Lions coming here with the Sphinx Stone to fall in London. And this wonderfully nice lady redirected us down to Chagrin Geode. Can you tell there's some sarcasm in my voice? I just feel like there's a snake in the woods here somewhere. All right, let's... um. Take a look. So, it, as I remember, it was supposed to be somewhere down south. I actually don't have it here. Um, the Great Geode, huh? Yeah, it's not here. So that means I'm going to have to get down here and take a look. So I'm going to come back past the canal, and we'll see what happens. Let's get out of here. I'm not fully loaded on fuel and um, supplies. I do have more supplies and food or fuel than I need. But uh, hopefully we'll run into something and I can pick up some extra fuel. We'll see. Uh, let's turn off that light. All right, let's go down there. We'll, we'll, I'll meet you at the canal. And we made it to the Great Canal down here. Let's see where we're going to go. We're going to listen to some gossip. Moves in the great game. Get a port report. We're done. Nothing really to shop I want to do here, right? I can buy. Why not? I'm going to buy one fuel. Pop top myself up a little bit. Um, and then we're going to head on out. Now we're going to start to explore below us. Looking for the Great Geode. So we made it to the Iron Republic. Hell's client state. Be wary, their laws are not the laws of man or nature. Iron Republic. Factory engines roar like false lions. Blood thunders in the dock pipes. Crimson lightning skitters across the decks, leaping to the rail, curls there like a cat. The city is reflected in glassy, calm harbor water. The citizens there have the heads of dogs and serpents. Hell has brought freedom to the Iron Republic. Freedom from all laws, even those of nature. Um, let's see, I can listen. You need 70 terror. I don't have enough terror, so I can't listen. Um, and something awaits. So, actually, <laughs> so that's a note here, right? Let's insert this. Uh, Iron, Re Iron Republic, right? Iron. Let's switch back and forth here. Iron Republic. Republic. And one of the things I want to do here is 70 terror or greater. And let's see what else I got here. Um, engage an officer, the irrepressible cannoneer. It substantially increases iron, huh? Don't, don't I have a gunner? I do. Of course I have a gunner already. Irrepressible something awaits. Unlock with 20 echo and I'm broke. <laughs> allow your sailor some time ashore can't do that either uh iron republic days no more than four market the hungers parliament of flies compile a report yeah let's compile a report see what happens the sensation of the republics are overwhelming there is a desire for years that is a hatred for f there. <laughs> that is a hatred for fountains. Here is an emotion that can only be expressed mathematically. Now you are awash with the nostalgia for the hatching of the egg. Write it down. Write it all down. Perhaps you'll be rid of it. The Parliament of Flies is open for business. Tales of Terror. Okay. Go back in. Let's go to the Parliament of Flies. Visit Shops tab. After the visit, the Parliament will no longer be there. The Republic will seek zoop and supplies instead. Oh, boy. And I'm broke. 
Shintelak, Romantic League Literature, A Dread Dermise. Oh, it's just Searing Enigmas. Hmm. You can buy Parabola. One. Oh, all right, so. Um, so it says if I go back, it'll be gone, right? Yep, it's gone. Nothing I could have done about it. I didn't have anything to buy there. So that means I have to go in here and unlock it again. Market of Hungers. Calvary Doctrine. So I feel like I might have just blown something, but I don't know what it was. All right. In any case, let's head on down. We're going to continue to head south a bit. See if we can push our luck. Alrighty, we took a look around here. Uh, let's just jump into Pig Mode Island and see what's going on. Resolve their dilemma. A new nation has been founded. Request repairs, visit the ghetto, compile a report, steal the rat star. <laughs> now, let's do this one. Resolve our dilemma here. A dilemma. How will you advise Pigmont Island? Time passes on Pigmont Island. Suggest they raise conscription. Let's see. The aid talks to you, uh, takes you to the coast where the huts still smolder from the last pirate attack. Those beastly raiders keep coming from our pre precious Chintelac. It squeaks, shaking a pod in impotent fury rage. How can we protect our shores, hairless advisor? Uh, it will be unpopular, but safety must come first. Uh, re recommend they accept the loss. No, no, no. Fight. Fight, fight, fight. Unhappy soldiers. Parents nuzzle their pups farewell, holding back the tears just long, long enough. The conscripts waddle towards the training camp and hastily made ill-fitting armor. You gain one pigmoat might. You've lost two pigmoat spirit. You've, uh, you have to resolve. You have to resolve the dilemma, for better or worse. It's all get fifty fragments. Very well. Very well. Compile a report. And do I want to make... What's this here? No, I don't want to steal it. Marine has not been kind to its enemies. Unlock memoirs. Time passes. Let's go ahead and visit the ghetto. See what happens. Success will improve your spirit. Island spirit. Yes, please. Uh, impossible challenge. Broker a union. 10% not happy. Assist the Cavi revolution. But cost me five veils. What is the Rat Star? I don't know. Let's do this one here. A sly delivery. The regular gate guards do not dare search the hairless advisor. A few careful lies get you and your supplies through without incident. The starving cavies have little to repay your kindness, but offer what little they have managed to keep them from. So, Big Mode Island Spirit is up one. Good. Lost some spirits. So I'm still in danger, but I need to get it up there. You have... Oh my god. I gave away all my food. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's bad. That is very bad. All right, so let's take a look. Um, I have no money. Yeah, that the purchase for the boy. You know, I, I couldn't help it. My my son. I had to pay for my son. Let's get back to the uh, the. Oh God, I'll never make it. I I'm gonna have to hope to hit something along the way to get some supplies. That's my only hope. Or I'm gonna start starving to death. First, we eat the rat. <laughs> <laughs> oh god all right so i also oh hello you dinner 
dinner is here. Come on, dinner time. Come on, dinner time. Oh, he just got out of range. Come back, dinner. That's one hit. Nice. Let's hide. Still not quite got us yet. Nice. One more shot, and he's mine. He's going to come in and charge. Now. Yes. <laughs> All right. Uh, scoop it up. You betcha. Thank you, God. Thank the Lord I got some food. <laughs> All right. On to London. The horrors below. Zaylers the rail call softly. Something swims beneath the ship. I saw it looking up at us. One of them says the voice of tremble. Don't look. Or very chancy challenge. Bring out the nets. Let's catch it. Go for it. You gain a terror. You failed. Damn it. He got away. All right. Okay, we're at there. Approach the dock is probably nothing. The ship slides into dock. Time passes on Mutton Island. Something's changed on Mutton Island. Where is everyone? No, just, just no. <laughs> A still sleepy evening. Something is different. Fewer coils of smoke rise from the chains. Half the windows are dark. Even this early. What's going on? Let's explore. Um, you peer through black a black window. You see a table laid with silvery cutlery and the ashes white in the hearth. The rug is crumpled, untidy. A solitary boot lies on it. Singing rises from the crook and magpie. Roush's rustic roll voices accompanied by a jangling piano. The man in the well is a popular ditty in these parts, but you've rarely heard it performed with such gusto. Great. The place got raided. All right. I can explore the town. I can visit this thing. Let's do the town. Let's see what we find first. Cold hearts. You peer through black windows. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already done that. Explore town. Okay, so here we go. Let's go in and find out what's happening. Um. Oh, boy. You enter the singing stops. The locals crammed into the crooked tap room turn to look at you. The table creaks beneath a lavish spread. Bowls of plump ivory beans and peas as big as bullets. Golden potatoes, crunchy with fat. A vast roasting dish in which a human carcass, trussed nearly with twine, sizzles in its juices. A custodial chef carves it like a Sunday roast. Ah, he says, lifting his knife. Regrettable timing. Capture them, brothers and sisters. We'll string them in the well in anticipation of a less fortunate times. You have stumbled across the appalling feast. You are no stranger to such crimson feasts. Nope, pull up a chair. I don't think so. <laughs> I can run for it. Very chancy. I get a 44. Or I can fight. God. All right. It's going from bad to worse. Let's, let's just run for it. I failed. <laughs> Before you're out of the pub, a solemn stroker goes under, down under a gaggle of mutton chops uh, for the villagers. As you race through the twisted streets, a second troop of locals descend from the well atop the hill. You are clad in white smocks and carry candles. They catch you in the flank and you lose a recalcitrant look, lookout. You are at the jetty when your springy deckhand, whose reputation outweighs his ability, falls to an expertly flung fishing net. The rest of you make it back to the ship and out to sea. You're still catching your breath when you spy an admiralty frigate making for the Quaker's Haven. Perhaps you weren't the first to escape the island. Ooh. I now have an intriguing snippet. We say someone will be interested. Okay. Uh, the blockade of Mutton Island. The, the frigate is blocking the jetty, preventing you from landing. The Mutton Island's under quarantine, a uh, YM lookout calls to the shaky voice, until such time as proper manners and appetites are restored. Okay, I got myself a, a port. Port. Yay. All right, let's get back to um, town, shall we? And I'm slow because I don't have enough peoples. 
Well, there's somebody waiting for me back at town. But I'm going to be going slow. No, that means I'm going to eat more food. <laughs> okay, let's see if we make it. We've made it to London. Let's breathe a sigh of relief. My terrors remain unchanged. Collect my my, ha my my Harbor Master stuff here. Something changed. Someone wants to sign on. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Where, where's the sign on? A little gift. A very fine evening to you, Captain. My, what you might call a mentor is very fond of adventures, Z Captains, and he would like to offer you what you might call a dispensation on account of he is so fond of Z Captains. Behind the blind bruiser on the dock stands a dray piled high with fuel and supplies. Really? Accept the dispensation, inquire further. Is there a catch? Absolutely going to inquire. He runs a very fine, very liberal establishment just across the river, what is much patronized by sailors and by men of wit and vinegar. In the public house, there is no obligation to speak of. My patron only hopes that you might remember him kindly, and I suppose that if that opportunity should arise for you to return his kindness, then I do not imagine he would refuse your offer. Okay, I'll take it. Nice. Wow. Okay. Can I get rid of this stuff? I can't sell it now, can I? Where do you want me to go? Oh, jeez. I don't know. Um, I really don't know. Let's go back. Let's um, reject this, please, for the moment. Um, alarming scholar. Let's go with the memory. That should increase me up. I'm at four. That's cool. Takes a serious offer. Intriguing. What? An intriguing snippet. That gets me what? Uh, one change point, need four more for five. My lodgings. Rest, sell, purchase. Reconsider Mr. Sachs. Consider retirement. <laughs> I'm thinking about it, man. Visit your study. A private sanctuary. Um, I don't think there's anything I can do here, right? Not yet? Right, 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 right. I need stuff to create these things. Um, my lodgings again. Time with my family. Um, yeah, let's go talk to the child again. Tell him some more stuff. He's now at eight. I've lost 20 terror. Well, that's actually awesome. Talking to the kid is great. Um, I think there's nothing here at the market because I just did the whole thing, yeah. So, now we're at the Admiralty. I have room for nothing, actually. Hold on, wait, wait. Go to the shop. I got something to sell, don't I? Yeah, so sell one of those. Hey, look, I got some cash. All's not lost. Hey, you. Uh, let's submit a report. Wait, speak of moves in the great game. Favor echoes. Okay. I'm getting cash again. Sweet. Submit some reports. I have room for one fuel, so I can get one fuel from a report here. Let's go here. Did I get anything? Nope, just cash. How about here? Fuel and cash. Okay. So I'm full up. I might want to. Well, shoot. I'm gonna. Have to, I'm. I'm going down that direction again. So I'm gonna hit these places anyway. So let's go for the cash. Baker's Heaven, 
Another five cash. And I think that's done. All right, so I think Venture's Desire, what is this? Bales of, of whatever, right? Seven Ashland and Artifacts or seven bales of Parabola and Linden, which is a lot of cash if I go that route. All right, do I have enough time? I don't know. I'm, I'm almost all the way down to the bottom here. And this kind of taxed me, but then again, I, I used two food at Pigmoat Island. So I could go back. I think I have enough to get down here and clear out a little bit more. Maybe get far enough and just see if I can find this, this geode place. Um, damn. Taking that, taking that deal when I didn't know where geode was was probably a bad thing. I think. So come back and join me. We'll do another one. Take care. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching another episode of Dexter Plays. Please leave a like or subscribe and post any tips or tricks down below.